Hi everyone. In this video I'd like to show you some activities you can do with vibration and sound. Let's get at it. The first activity is easy. It just requires a ruler. And you can change the length. It will change the vibration. Next activity, we'll stretch some saran wrap tightly over the bowl. And we'll take some coffee beans, whoops, and put them on the drum and see if we can see the sound or the vibration move the beans. We'll use a tuning fork. You can see a little mo movement. If I touch, and transfer the sound to the saran wrap, you can see the vibration. Whoa! Okay, clean up. Now that I've cleaned up, let's try it again. A different activity we can use to see the vibration with water. And again, we'll use the tuning fork. And you can see the vibration. Another fun one to see a vibration is to take a ping pong ball and just tape or attach somehow a string to the ball and you can hang it from something and then take a tuning fork In this activity, you can make some music by taking different levels and playing with the levels. Let's give that a try.
Now that's a little hard to hear. So you can use a, a metal spoon. And you can find an app where you can see what the sound is, how many, what the frequency is. Let me show you. So you can tune you can tune it by just adding or subtracting water. Now you should take your time and try to make notes but for this video I'm just going to add some and make it short. Let's see what I did. Not too bad. Oh, I almost made the song. Anyway, it's fun to play with this. And if you don't have uh, these types of jars, you can try to use anything, any jar that you have. even a drinking glass and play with the levels to get your frequency that you want. Anyway, have some fun with sound and vibration.